my channel. For those of you who are new here, hi and welcome and welcome to today's video. So today's video is going to be an inside the dressing room at Target. I think I did this about two months ago perhaps, I'm not sure. But I thought I would revisit and see because now it is spring here in Australia and I wanted to see what was in Target. So I thought let's bring you guys in and let's try some stuff on. What also got me thinking about Target was, um, I don't know if you guys follow Sam, uh, Curvy Sam is her handle. Uh, so she's really great, she's an Australian um, plus size blogger and does a lot of stuff so if you don't follow her on Instagram. So she sort of brought up um, something in relation to Target and you know what was us as consumers, like what's our idea on the fitting and stuff like that. So I thought you know what I'm gonna go check it out and actually see again. Because I feel like the first time when I went I was kind of successful but you know I really only found about five things. So I'm thinking I'm gonna give it a go again and see again and see like can I actually find things at Target because the Australian Target is very different to the American Target and in Australia a lot of our stores on the on the plus size it's still very like old school frumpy looking you know we're not on trend uh, the regular section is fine but it's the plus size so I'm gonna go have a look I think it's called curve at Target uh, we'll go have another look today see how successful we are and I'll probably also try some stuff from the regular section to see if it'll fit because their regular section does go up to a size 20 however in my opinion I don't feel like it's a plus 20 I just feel like it kind of I don't know slowly works its way up like 16 and 20 but it's not a true 20 because you know it like yeah that's my opinion okay so uh, let's head on over to Target and see what happens in the dressing room and we'll come back for a little discussion later okay guys so I'm in the Target dressing room and this is my outfit for today just a black skirt with the zip I've had this for years but I love it and my purple cardigan I actually I really just wanted to show you inside the dressing room because it has these lights around the mirror which are fantastic so it gives you great lighting and it's also like energy saving so as you move back it kind of turns off and as you move closer it turns on and I really just want to point that out because it's probably like the best dressing room I've seen to date so we have outfit number one which is this really cute skirt it is pleated all the way around uh, and it goes up on the sides a little bit so it's not even length all the way around and it's black on the top and this lovely peachy color down the bottom it's actually really cute it's not something I would normally consider for myself but when I put it on I thought this is really cute it reminded me of like a dancing dress like if I was in dirty dancing or something I don't know but it's really really cute I liked it um, it's actually from the regular section not from the plus section but it has quite a bit of stretch in it so I was actually glad about that because normally some of the skirts don't fit me in that section but I really like this and I think it's it's really quite cute so you could pair it with a shirt or a black top or something like that and it's super cute for going out somewhere and it's only 49 bucks which is not too bad and I'm trying on the in the biggest size in the small section which is size 20. So this next dress that we have is a little bit frumpy when first put on because I think I got a size that's too big. However, once you cinch in the waist with the tie that comes with it, it looks so much better. And you can't really tell that much that it is big on me because as you can see on the camera it doesn't look that bad it is really quite nice it's just a dress you could totally wear this to work or during the day really nice navy blue um, it is actually from the plus section so that was quite nice and I really like how the stripes go down it's sort of something different normally I don't really like stripes down I feel like it looks like pajamas <laughs> however I did didn't mind this at all I might have I should have tried on perhaps a smaller size because I really felt the arms were really baggy which I don't know not really the style I normally as you guys know but I didn't mind this at all what do you guys think of this one? Um, this one was also $39, so that's not too bad, especially if there's a sale. So this next top is just a plain white tee with some stripes going across it. Nice and simple, very nice and soft material, which I liked. And I did like the V-neck up the top. 
this is an everyday top I did actually find this in the regular section and it came in a size 20 which as I've said before is the biggest size in the regular section however this is just a plain top that you could probably get at any old store so it's nothing too fancy but Target does have a good range of just plain casual stuff that's sort of staple items so that's not too bad however I did like the way this top fit it's probably not a true 20 I would say but nevertheless the t-shirt did fit me well and it was only 12 bucks so this next item is this shirt that was probably an item that I least liked because it's not my style at all I thought I would just try it on because you know we all have different tastes and this might be something that might suit somebody else perhaps with a different shape perhaps someone who doesn't have breasts as big as mine because I feel like it just didn't look good because it comes out a lot because of my breasts and there's no way for really for it to come in and show that I have any sort of shape I really like the pattern the pattern is nice but this style has no stretch or anything so definitely not one for me and also I find a little bit pricey for a shirt at $49 at Target so in this next top is just from the regular section it is just a nice plain black top with without any sleeves it is this ribbing material which allows it to stretch quite a bit it's just a regular fit regular top now um, it's a little bit too high waisted for my liking but i'm sure a lot of other people would suit them much better however this is a nice simple work top or a top that you could wear under a jacket very simple uh, everyday look something that target generally does have they do have a lot of everyday items that go with anything and probably quite classical looking uh, as i said this was in the regular section and it was only 20 bucks and in the biggest size that it had was double xl and that's all from the dressing room for now meet you back at home so I'm back from Target and as you would have seen I did try on a few items some of them were just in the regular section and some were in the bell curve section um, from what I could see in the curve section there really wasn't absolutely anything that was my taste at all um, we all have different tastes which I totally understand but I am certainly not for big baggy shirts and I mean, I know I'm a bigger girl, but I don't like hiding my curves. That That's life. Tough luck. If you don't like it, don't watch me. But, you know, and some people prefer that style, so that's not my style. And all I saw was just big, huge shirts and um, some pants, pretty much. That was it. There was nothing exciting. No dresses, skirts that were like stand out florally you know especially now coming that it's spring you know you want something nice so a little bit disappointing this time uh they still had the jeans i didn't try on any because they were the exact same jeans as last time and yeah that's it i mean denny minogue has a beautiful section in in the petites it would be really nice if you know she did plus sizes because some of that stuff is so so pretty so that would be nice so hopefully in time you know People, designers, you know, will come up with some more plus sizes, especially in Australia. We need we need more options here. Like, you know, I feel like all I resort to is having to buy online all the time because that's what I can find in what kind of what's on trend at the moment. And also what, what I can find that's not grandma stylish, dare I say. But um, yeah, okay, that's enough of a rant from me today. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Please don't forget to subscribe and like this video. And I'll see you guys soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.